I'm Dominic Panza, live from Clipper Magazine Stadium for MSBN. I'm joined by Millersville relief pitcher Adam Zipko, and terrific in relief today, three innings. How did you feel out there on the mound? Uh, it felt great. Uh, felt good with defense behind me, uh, throwing ground balls. They did a great job. Uh, even Tim, Tim before me uh, did a fantastic job today, bouncing back after fresh minutes. How important was it to get that first three outs immediately once you got inserted into the ball game. That's big, especially as a reliever coming in uh, towards the end of the games. Uh, you know, you need to get get guys out that you job uh, just through strikes uh, and worked out for me. In your second inning of work, you gave up the double, but you were able to calm down. And then you move into the ninth, get the first couple of outs, it gets a little hairy. What are you thinking at that point? Uh, you know, as a pitcher, a relief pitcher, you can't think can't think about that being a tie run. Um, you just got to go keep throwing strikes. Fine. Did it cross your mind at all that it was the same guy that hit the blast that tied the game last week in the conference no, tournament? not at all. I mean, I, I didn't even know his name. It doesn't come to your mind. Uh, things like that. You're just in the zone. You keep throwing strikes. So now the Marauders are in a great situation. What are you planning on doing to prepare for tomorrow's championship round? I'm just going to take it one pitch at a time like we've been doing all year. Um, same routine. Stick, stick with it. Uh, and I'm sure we'll come out on top. Well, Adam, great game today. Thanks for joining Thank us, you. and best of luck tomorrow. That was Adam Zipko. I'm Dominic Panza for MSBN.